What's up guys, it's your boys, and we'll get back with another scary, terrifying, and creepy video from TV. We are about to watch his chain to the wall in a haunted basement horrifying footage. So I was like, okay, sold. We're going to watch it right now. So grab a chair, grab some popcorn as we get ready to watch TV. and it looks like Casey is going down in this basement being attached to this uh, wall or chained to the wall and something's going to go bad. So let's take a look. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe right now by hitting that white bar icon down the bottom right. Smack that bell icon next to it so that I do post videos like this one. You'll get that little ring notification that's Wilkie myself has posted that video. Then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, thank you guys so very much for the continued love and support that all of you guys show on this channel every single day. I can't thank you guys enough. Keep doing what you guys are doing and we'll continue to grow together. We are so close to 16,000 subscribers. I know never would have guessed that we would get here and it's all because of you guys so keep doing what you guys are doing and speaking of growth and uh support check out the link in the description for mindseed tv themselves go over there help casey and colton grow their youtube channel even more than the 1.6 million that they already have but watch their old stuff watch their new stuff did i say watch their old stuff watch their okay and with that being said don't forget to subscribe comment like and share and then with that being said i want to see how horrifying this footage is Behind me right now is the Arlington Plantation. Ooh. We've done an investigation here in the past. Oh. The last time that I was here, there was a silhouette. It looked like a little girl in the basement. Tonight, I'm gonna be spending the entire night chained up to the wall in the basement until sunup. Why? Myself. Colton is gonna go to a hotel down the street. And I'm gonna have the keys with me. And we're gonna have communication through walkie-talkies, so wish me luck. We're gonna go set it up, set the chains up, lock me in. My dude is and then nuts! And head to the hotel. <laughs> He's like, hold my beer. Warning, this video contains scenes and moments that are not for the faint of heart. These chilling images and hair-raising encounters may leave a lasting impression on you. Haunting your thoughts <laughs> and dreams oh. for days. View, 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 viewer discretion is advised. You've been warned. This may truly be the scariest video we have ever filmed. Ever filmed. Challenge accepted. I just hope that there's nobody living in here. Honestly. Hello, hello. If they had a figure last time, anybody's in here. This is gonna be fantastic. We're not, We're not here to rest you. Not here to harm you. Just checking out the property. I want to see it. Oh, we got a couch in here. This is new. Ooh, somebody's been, um... That's troublesome. I'm um, not living there, but, um, what, squatting? What, like somebody stays here? Yeah. Like a squatter? Yeah. I mean, someone comes here and either sleeps here. This might be somebody's in crib, bro. Seeing a couch was definitely unsettling because a lot of places that we go to are abandoned and with It's like, oh my gosh, it's a couch. <laughs> with abandoned buildings comes the real possibility of squatters, homeless people, or even people on the run from authorities. I'll be, I'll be down here. Hell oh, no. Oh, I'm nervous, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. Hell no. If somebody shows up here while I'm chained up to the wall, you're gonna have to hurry up. I got a knife on me, but still, yeah. I'd rather not. They should put a uh, camera outside that hole. Uh, chained to the wall is basically like being cornered. Yeah, exactly. Again, he's like, hold my beer. I'm going to chain myself to a wall in a haunted building. What's back there? Uh, I remember there was like this weird broken down kitchen out there. I definitely felt the feeling of deja vu being there. I'm not and chaining myself. Even though it's been four years, a lot of the rooms looked untouched and unchanged. Hello, hello. Are you guys hearing stuff? Because I'm hearing here? stuff. What is all this junk? Oh, I remember this from the episode. Yeah, there was something living up there in like one of these nooks. Damn. I'd be afraid this of getting hepatitis from all of those. Yeah, that's that's wind. 
Like getting caught on the nail. Ooh. I think I heard something up there. That's wind. Yeah. One thing that's definitely a bit eerie, and I remember feeling this while we were on this investigation, that's was definitely the fact wind. that four years ago, I heard a very distinct humming noise while I was in the basement, and it sounded like a kid humming a melody. Okay, that's hey, different. Solid four now. Hey, Here we go. Dude, I swear to God. It sounded like a kid humming like something. It did. Like humming. Stairwell to the basement is right underneath here. That is where it gets weird. Oh yeah. You heard that, right? I did hear that. Could it be an ammo? Or is it something in distress and fear? Are you ready? I think so. I'm probably gonna need both hands for this, so I'm gonna put my phone up. You're all good. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm gonna need both hands for this. What? I'm talking about an ice cream cone. Take your time, bro. Take your time. There's something Once haunted. I went down to the basement, the realization that I was going to be trapped down there the whole night started to really sink in. Yeah, He's nuts. So where's the, how's he gonna be chained? Like, are they gonna like? Where did you see that thing? Chain him to a piece of wood? I think. I think it was in one of these like caved in rooms. It's kind of hard to remember. It's been so long. Bro. Myself, I'd be more scared about spiders. The ambiance music this is was terrifying. It, dude. Oh We're back boy. Here in the worst of it. This is where we saw her. Yeah, it was like a girl sitting with her back turned, like, right. Ah! By far, the scariest thing that happened four years ago when I was at this location was there was a phantom figure we captured on camera. You a child? How do you not see that? Can you tell me or make the temperature go to five? Oh, my gosh. Oh. How do oh, he saw it. Okay something in the room it looked to me like a small dark figure sitting indian style with its back facing towards us and i noticed it briefly ah. in the shadows when we were filming but when we went back and looked the second time it was not there oh 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 there was no way to explain <laughs> what we had captured it looks like a woman in sitting Indian style. Is this where you want to do it? You tell me. That's what she said. <laughs> oh. I mean, I guess. We said it would be the same room that she was in. So when we came up with this brilliant idea. You couldn't pay me to do this. Just saying. I guess I could be. Not going to happen. I guess we want to pick the clearest section. I think I'm going to make camp right around here. But, like, where is he going to attach himself? To work? Yeah. Okay. He's like, I'm having second thoughts. Oh, so they're, like, going to... Oh, he brought the big impactor out. Oh, yeah, he's he's going the distance here. You are out of your dang mind. Holy hell. He's going into it, man. 
I like to say he's going balls deep, but he's not. He's going like steel balls deep. Oh my gosh, he's like, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna. I know too tight. I'm gonna be. <laughs> We'll keep the cut on this, but for everyone that says that you're full of shit, yeah, we'll make sure. You have the keys, right? What? You have the keys, right? We haven't lost those yet, right? Oh, fuck. Yeah. Just kidding. You got it? Let me see it. Let me what? just really see if you have the keys. <laughs> it's like, it's gonna be a long night, shoot, bro. I yeah, forget. I, I left the keys at home. Uh, so, uh, you're going to be watching the cameras? Yeah, I'm going to be fucking... On it. Oh, well, let's do a radio check. Yeah. Before Colton left, he set up a few more static cameras that he would be able to watch remotely. Oh, gosh. One on a REM pod upstairs, one on a hallway above the basement, and one in front of the front door facing a motion detector in case anybody were to actually enter the building. If, like, police roll up or something, I have to get over there quick with the key. Yeah, I feel you. <laughs> All yeah. right. You got a light on your way out? Yeah. Okay, cool. All right, well, good luck. Thanks, bro. Good luck? You better be saying some prayers and the Hail Marys for that man. Oh, and it's total darkness in there. Oh my gosh. Ah! I don't know. No, I don't I couldn't be paid. Nope. I don't think so. Would you guys be paid to be bolted to a wall? Comment down below. Me? No. Million dollars? Maybe. These guys were just bored at home on the couch. Like, you know what? Maybe it should be chained to a wall. This dude's freaking nuts. He's, he's doing it for the views. Uh oh. Check, check. Can you hear me? Yeah, we good? Oh, okay. Yeah, we're good. I was just making sure this thing's working before you dip out. All right, I'm out of here. Good luck, bro. You don't know what it feels like. You'll never be able to understand just by watching this video. Completely alone, chained to a wall in a basement of an abandoned building surrounded by woods, hearing the car drive off. This is how you get the girls, it okay? Was absolutely Take horrifying. notes. <laughs> Chain yourself to a wall in a haunted plantation. Darkness. That's how you get the curl. So I just got to the hotel. Um, it is a little bit more than a 10 minute drive to the basement where he's chained up. He's already hit me up like four or five times letting me know that he's like hearing stuff. He's feeling nervous. I'm kind of tripping. So I'm getting ready to set up the live feed right now. I'm hoping everything- This guy is nuts. So I can monitor what's going on. I am like literally just about to set it up right now. 10 minutes later. He's like, I need your help, man. Yo, I'm hearing noises and stuff down here. Uh, the rep pod already went off once. Have you seen anything weird on your camera? Nah, it looks good down here. There's a little delay from the mic, but that's it. It's already going off. Oh, have mercy. Son of a biscuit. If we see a shadow go past that, I would lose my shiznits. Well, that's as far as he's getting. See, look guys, he's chained to the wall. Don't say he's the BS. The is a cool device because it detects energy within a very close proximity. You literally have to be like right up on it in order to make this thing go off. So if it's going off and there's nobody within a foot or two away, there's something there that can't be seen. Okay, well, if there's something here that would like to communicate, I'm not going anywhere. I have a... EMF detector here. If you'd like to light this up, let me know that you're here. I can put it on the ground. 
Whoops. And you could come close to this if you'd like to show your presence. Or you can go next to that device over there again if you'd like. I'm not here to harm you, and I hope that you're not here to harm me. Swear, if he sees another woman, I'd just I'm like to know it. if uh, if there's the spirit of a little girl that's still here. Is there a little girl no. still residing within this building after the fire? Whoa, whoa, whoa! What was that? Hello. Did that just fall down? I remember at one point I heard a really loud bang, almost as if someone or something were in the air ducts of the basement. Residing within this building after the fire. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It looks like that duck over there fell down. Hello? It could have been an animal, who knows, but immediately after, the REM pod starts going nuts. Hey dude, I just heard a fucking loud bang. Can you please check the cameras? If you got it already set up. Cameras alive. He's, he's like, crap, I'm going to the bathroom. I don't know, I'm fucking tripping out, man. Your eye. What the oh, fuck? it's green now. Oh. What the fuck? It's touching it. It's a full grab. Because your eyes are going to play tricks with in the dark now. Okay, that was a pretty good indication that you're here with me right now. I'm going to turn on all these devices so that you could communicate with me if you'd like. Here. Here. Excel. So you could hear me, huh? It's using the Excel Microsoft? Microsoft Excel? Mark Rot. Mark Rot. Is sure there a mark in the ground rotting? Trapped. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, he's trapped. Are you trapped Peace. too? Child. Whoa. Peace. Child. It's, and it's spitting not out fast. Peace. Like peace as in a peaceful saying peace like a piece of a child it was a gross feeling like knowing the backstory of this place it seemed way too spot on to be a coincidence it kind of reminded me of the basement at the scratch house trapped peace child that i'm getting nervous for him up sequence of things for the obvious to say while i'm down here how are you is this a part one, part two thing? I don't so think hey so. guys, if you're enjoying today's video, now would be- I don't think it's a two-parter. Nope. It's a one-parter. He's probably like, Don't think come back! Should've brought like a, a little chair to sit on. Did he bring snacks? Doom? I'm waiting to see like a girl s sitting there again. What's going on, man? Nothing. I thought I just saw a little activity on the REM pod, so I kind of zoomed in. How you doing out there? Well, hey, hang in there. Um, yeah, you already crossed. You've been there almost two hours now. Feels like I've been here six, bro. <laughs> Fuck. It's like a, his own Saw movie. Hour three. There was a point in time where I started to doze off a little, leaning against the wall on the floor, 
and I was awoken by this really weird, weird sound. I know you guys could hear that. I don't know how to explain it, but it was like this echoing, pulsating noise from within the building. And it kind of sounded like voices that were a bit muffled. It was hard to tell. And then I also heard footsteps above me. Mm -hmm. Oh, I hear I it. I know you guys could hear that. It sounds like footprints or footsteps on wood, not on concrete. I'm waiting for that figure. I'm waiting for that figure, man. If there is any figure, that is. Watch, there's like a ghost in his room. Truthfully, when there wasn't any activity, it was just long, boring moments sitting in the dark in complete silence. <sighs> That's when you hear. What, he's got night vision? Oh my gosh. This is even more terrifying. Because he look. Oh, is that a bear trap? Oh my gosh. After sitting in silence for maybe 20 or 30 minutes, all of a sudden, Colton says something to me that made my heart sink to my stomach. Listen, bro, I don't want you to freak out right now, but there's someone or something in there with you. I just talked up past that camera in the hallway. I want to see this. What do you mean you saw something? Like a person? I saw something to interfere with the camera. I could see, like, the outline of the doorway that's behind it, and then it just went black. I saw something fly in the thing. Get me out of here! Alright, bro, but if there's someone here, I'm not fucking. Hold on. Yeah, chill out. I'm getting in the car right now. I'm gonna run down there. I'm gonna start. Yeah, I'm hearing footsteps and shit too. Uh, try to hurry up. Bad idea. I'm running down right now. I'll be there in like 10 minutes. At the time, I didn't know what he saw, so all these thoughts were running through my head. Oh my head. gosh. Someone being in the building, I was trying to be as silent as I possibly could. I went lights out with the infrared. And that 10 minutes waiting for him to get to the building felt like the longest 10 minutes of my life. I'm here, coming down. I wanna see the footage. Case. Case. We've learned that we always have to put our safety first, always, and the thought that there could possibly be other people in the building or even a chance of me getting arrested just for being there, it, it was in our best interest to just I mean, it could be the police. Way. They'll make themselves known, though. Bro, I don't know what, but I just saw some. After getting out of there, we went back and reviewed the footage, and this is what Ooh, I want to see captured it. when he thought someone was in the building. Bro, it's walking. What the hell? Looks like it went from... What the fudge? We played it back several times, and it could be a person. Possibly. Maybe. It's see-through. camera was glitching. But it seemed to be more transparent than anything. It's walking from the the right to the left, and then, like, ducks back. Oh, my goodness. 
Now, do I still think that that place is haunted? Oh, yes. I do. I heard things while I was there that were pretty unexplainable. Uh, voices, he footsteps, the devices were getting quite a there bit of activity. It definitely seems like it's still a hot spot late at night. And the fact that we caught something, whether it was a person or an apparition, is pretty much yet to be determined. That Personally, looks creepy. I think that what we captured was not a person, but rather an entity. Ultimately, think? that's up for you to decide. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you click this link right here. We did an investigation two weeks ago that will definitely blow your mind. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, Do it. stay tuned for more cool stuff. I hope you guys enjoy the ride. See you later. Peace. I like the ride. Do it. Make sure you guys subscribe to their channel, like their channel, share their channel, caress their channel, give them the love. There's a lot of people that are up in the air about these guys. If they're fake, they're real, whatever have you. I don't care. I love their channel. I love watching their stuff. If it's real, fantastic. If it's fake, fantastic. I don't care. I love the content they're putting out. I'm going to continue watching it, but I want to know your guys' thoughts down below. Make sure you guys like the, my video make sure you guys comment on the video if you guys thought it, this was heart pounding creepy whatever have you let me know would you be chained to a wall for, and stay down there for the three to four or five hours or the whole night let me know and then don't forget to subscribe join all the fifteen thousand subscribers that are here with me as well and we'll see you guys in the next video so keep it real keep it safe and as always keep nerding on and we'll see you guys next time Peace.